Hi people, uh, today's plan is to install this tachometer inside the dash of my uh, cutlass. This here is where it's going to go. Uh, my cutlass is a base model, so it didn't come with a clock or a tachometer here. It's just a blank. And so I'm going to uh, mount the tack in there. So it'll be inside the dash. It's a fairly small one. Um, so it'll be like inside and uh, with these decorative lines will still be present I hope that's the plan to have it look kind of nice that way so we'll see what we get okay I drilled out the hole it's two and a half inch tack so two and a half inch hole so I can put the tack in there and uh, it's centered fairly well though probably not perfect I think that's going to work okay here it is uh, installed in the bezel and uh, without the uh, extension piece put on but that gives a basic idea what it looks like i think this is going to be okay okay here it is all assembled with the uh, ex bezel extension on there it looks pretty good in there to me it's all installed on here like this it's not a very fancy hookup but it works and uh, i think i'll be happy with this now I'm going to put it in the dash and start the wiring. Okay, there it is. The tachometer is installed. It doesn't look too bad in there. Got the speedometer lit up. This one over here is dead, but you know, two out of three ain't bad. I'm running with this for right now. So the tachometer is in, um, I got the st steering column in and the brake pedals and all that. We're coming together pretty good. Next step is to start working on the seats and so then I can work on the placement of my ratchet shifter. There's a seat there, I'm gonna start messing with that right now. But that'll probably be the next video.